Hi everyone, yeah, I just wanted to do another video saying, you know, um, stay positive, stay healthy, stay focused, stay determined, stay well, stay motivated. Do what you want, do whatever makes you feel good and feel like you stand out. And um, yeah, do whatever makes you feel like you're important, that like you stand out. Um, yeah, do whatever makes you feel like you're important, like you stand out. Like for me, it's sort of growing my hair at this length because I feel like men just don't look like this anymore. Um, I sort of look kind of, yeah, slightly um, less masculine. And I, I love how I can change my look like this. I love how I can sort of give the impression that I've sort of looked different um, from having the short haircut and the beard like I did not even that long ago. Um, so I love how I can change my appearance. And it's like I said, do whatever makes you feel good, makes you feel like you stand out, makes you feel unique, makes you feel special. Because you go out and sometimes I, I just see... I just don't see any, any guys looking like, you know, sort of hairstyle with with the look. A lot of people are clean shaven, but just not the hairstyle. And like I said, I've got luscious, thick, juicy, dark hair. Why would I not do this when I've got the opportunity, when I have nice, luscious, thick, juicy, dark hair like this? Why would I not make the most of it and grow my hair out like this? Why would I have the sort of haircut you have when you're older, when, heaven forbid, you know, you're losing it, whatever? That's the sort of haircut, I hate to say it, but it is the sort of haircut you get with a faded style or even a sh really short ha size and a little bit longer on top, which looks weird anyway. I don't like I don't like haircuts that are in balance. I never have. So I wouldn't hate to have short size and a long top, floppy top. I'd rather just have it all short then. So, But no, um, do whatever makes you feel good. Do whatever makes you feel important, makes you feel you stand out. Uh, motivate yourself. Drive yourself. It's a new year. It might be a new you. Change your appearance, experiment, why not? If we're able to go out luscious, thick, juicy, dark hair like I have, or just luscious, thick hair, doesn't matter what colour really. I mean, dark hair stands out more on, you know, sort of my skin tone anyway. But I'm just saying, you know, it just, you know, if you can go nice, luscious, thick, juicy hair out, even if it's, you know, not quite as dark as mine, because I've got very dark hair, but it doesn't matter. Like I said, make the most of it. Grow, grow it out, because a lot of men, you know, who have dark hair like I've got, they're not making the most of it, I don't think, by having a short haircut because the colour goes. I've said this over and over again for so many videos. And so you're probably getting bored of me saying it. But, you know, like I said, motivate yourself and do what feel like you stand out. Like I said, I feel like I've, um, sometimes I feel like I've got the nick of the haircut style. Um, I feel like, you know, it doesn't, it's, there's no comparison. If you go outside and see a guy with a short haircut or a short back and size or a faded haircut, or you, you can imagine me going out looking like this. There is no, there's no comparison. I would stand out more. They would be getting flustered over me, not the other way around. I wouldn't be getting flustered over some guy with a fucking bland short haircut with half the colours gone because they've got it that short at the size and it's faded funny. You think I'm going to get jealous over that? No, that's not going to happen. They're going to get jealous over luscious, thick, juicy, dark hair in a style that has just gone from fashion, which I think is a massive, massive, massive shame. The Beatles, all these old bands luscious stick juicy hair from the 70s 80s and it's it's just not there anymore even the one direction hairstyles but even then i don't know whatever but yeah make the most of it get out travel and do whatever makes you feel like you stand out i think i've got the nick of this now i was going to get a trim i'm so not going to get a short haircut anytime soon i might get a shortage haircut in the summer but guess what that's another five months away so i might not even get a haircut for another five months i i, I, I don't mind i don't mind the hair over the years i don't mind the size being i like looking like this i like i feel on top of the world looking like this I go out and I feel so fucking amazing. I feel so incredible because I look at every guy and I'm thinking, I look so different from everyone. No one has this hairstyle. No one grows out. I might see the odd guy, but really it's incredibly rare. No guys have this hairstyle. You can imagine, I look how feminine I look now. That's how I love, I love how I can do this. I love how I can go from short haircut and a beard to looking like this. I absolutely love it. I love it. I love it how I feel like I'm the only guy who's not afraid to experiment like this. And I absolutely love it. I love going out looking like this. I look, I go by the Turkish barbers and I look at them and I almost, I'm all, I almost burst out into laughter. I'm thinking, oh, you've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. I love looking like this. Like I said, I've gone clean shaving. It works with a short haircut. Guess what? The beard probably does suit a short hair. You can, it works with it. But oh my God. Yeah. Change your appearance. Love your life. New year, new me. And um, don't regret anything.